Welcome to another in our series of videos celebrating the recipients of the 2019 and 2020 ACM Awards. This video celebrates those honored with the 2019-20 and 2020-21 ACM Athena Lecturer Award. ACM celebrates and advocates internationally for the full engagement of women in all aspects of the computing field. The Athena Award, named for the Goddess of Wisdom, is presented annually to a prominent computer scientist who, like Athena, embodies strength, determination, and intelligence. This award has a $25,000 honorarium provided by Two Sigma. The 2019-2020 ACM Athena Lecturer is Sarit Kraus, Barilan University. I develop intelligent agents that interact proficiently with people. They are autonomous, they know how to plan, they adapt to the environment, and they're able to learn. The contributions of Sarit Kraus span the theoretical foundations, experimental evaluations, and practical applications of artificial intelligence. Kraus's agents interact with each other and with people in both cooperative and conflicting scenarios. Their ability to model the desirable behavior reflect her deep understanding of human behavior and decision-making. Now, what can this agent do? They can help people, they can replace people, and they can be used to train people. Kraus developed Diplomat, the first automated agent to negotiate with people in the game diplomacy. This prompted her to apply game theory and non-classical logics to strategic negotiation. She also made key contributions to knowledge representation and to randomized security applications. Throughout her career, Sarit Kraus has received numerous honors and prizes, served as an outstanding educator and mentor to her students, and been a valued contributor to the computing community. Our 2020-2021 Athena lecturer is Ayana Howard, Ohio State University. And so part of making robots smarter is actually trying to mimic humans. Ayana Howard is a leading roboticist, entrepreneur, and educator. At NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab, she introduced new ideas in robot learning to address the terrain classification of field robots a key hurdle for robots operating in unstructured natural field environments. Her research advanced the state of the art, including finding evidence of never-before-observed life on Antarctica's seafloor. At Georgia Tech, she encoded caregivers' social techniques into humanoid service robots in order to improve services for special needs children. In 2013, she founded Zyrobotics, an assistive technology company to help special needs kids, including those with severe injuries. Well, what happens if you have a robot that makes decisions and you trust it? Does it impact your own decisions? An expert on the overtrust placed in robots in autonomous decision-making settings, Howard introduced algorithms to quantify how robot mistakes affect human trust. This led to a better understanding of bias in AI and robotic systems. We have different geographies, different countries, different cultures. How does a robot that is collaborative then work with all these variances if we don't keep diversity at the forefront of our minds, of our developing? Our warmest congratulations to our 2019-20 and 2020 to 21 Athena lecturers. Thank you for watching.